the viewers around the world, 1988. And in both those games, United lost and they conceded an own goal. And in that 2-2 we were talking about just a minute ago, there was an own goal again, Marcus Rojo. So that's something that uh, the United players will want to avoid here tonight. Well, there was a time when they were lining up, there were no handshakes across the line. When you think... Uh, Even more interest in this FA Cup tie. football on every night of the week such is its popularity this promises to be a Friday night feast the start of a, a long weekend of fourth round FA Cup action well the team news for you had a check in his last season before retirement comes in in goal for Arsenal Ainsley Maitland-Niles is needed at right back for the unlucky Hector Bellerin who's now out for the season one other change from the side which beat Chelsea so convincingly here on Saturday, Alex Iwobi is in for Matteo Genduzzi. United also field their second-string goalkeeper Sergio Romero. Eric Bailly gets his first action since he was sent off against Bournemouth last month, and Luke Shaw has recovered from the illness which ruled him out of the last league game. Romelu Lukaku and Alexis Sanchez have had to play second fiddle under Solskjaer. Enjoy the game. Manchester United in a chain strip. Someone trying to unpick the lock here with the help of Alexis Sanchez. Check came out well. The danger hasn't passed, he knows that. Back in position. Tomorrow doesn't go with the run of Pogba. Sure. Trying to lift it back in, but it checked right on top. Pogba cut a path through the middle. Pizet wins it quite fairly for Arsenal. Aubameyang. About his athleticism and his defensive qualities. Right, the Niles making good ground. Jacker. And again, Aubameyang's on the move. And so too is Iwobi. Could have fizzed it across towards Aubameyang. Side the goal, Romero got plenty behind it and hung on. This is where Arsenal were at their best. The passing in and around the box. Great movement from Lacazette. No to Lacazette. Is that again? Once it just played in behind that group of Arsenal players like this. Staffy comes across, Lukaku coming into the middle, certainly drifted away from his uh, markers. Roby in the end, well, he's going to stop him on his left foot. It's a lovely ball for Alexis Sanchez, who goes round check and puts it into the net and scores for Manchester United against his old club at his former home on his return to the team. It's a goal that will be reviewed as to, uh, I guess, an offside call. But it was put away with great expertise. Well, look at it, Solskjaer. I said he might be the man for the occasion here, Alexis Sanchez. And it looks as though that uh, thought has produced some reality here. Well, it's a great play from Lukaku as well. Just drops into this area. Well, he's onside by quite some way. Great run. Great timing of the pass and angle of the pass from Lukaku. And... Alexis Sanchez, this is a good touch. He has to take, almost take it square. Petacek can't get there, can't bring him down either. Still a lot to do. Probably a good job that Pogba didn't go to try and head it in. He was in an offside position. This is good play from Match United all round. And give credit to Romelu Lukaku. Not known for his creativity in and around the box. More of a powerful player, but what a pass that was. And what a decent ball too, and Manchester United are in again here with Lukaku, with Lingard, time to take a touch, time to score, 2-0 for the team from Old Trafford and Lukaku has made both of them, one for Sanchez, one for Lingard, they've hit Arsenal with both barrels. Well, we've got to give credit to Manchester United and Ole Gunnar Solskjaer for playing Romelu Lukaku on that right-hand side, why does Koscielny try and step up to play offside here, there he goes, tries to step up, just defend the space and from that moment on three versus two, it was always going to be trouble for Arsenal composed finish you have to say from Lingard Lukaku picks out the right pass a decent first touch players are racing back at him but he just passes it beyond Petr Cech. 
What a couple of minutes for Manchester United here. Jesse Lingard, cool as you like. He's trying to stay onside, he's done that. Shaw sure supporting him again. Back for Lingard. Jacker. He goes on. Ramsey has a, crap. a hefty wage. Ramsey. And Obama Yang gets one back. It's just what Arsenal needed with half time approaching. Coming in at the right place at the right time. They were almost overloading the Manchester United defence in front of Romero there. And it was just a matter of who was going to tap, tap it in. Obama Yang did. Well, that's where the threat's been down that left hand side. Two easier possession Arsenal. Ramsey just to change of pace goes past Herrera, plays it into the six yard box. Certainly not offside, Obama Yang. Too easy for Arsenal down that left hand side. Good pass from Alan Ramsey. And Obama Yang just biding his time at the far post. Goes between the legs of Bay. There's a little touch. There's another one from Lacazette. And a simple finish from Obama Yang. And what a game we've got on. A different angle on it to Craig Pawson. Three added minutes. Primarily mm -hmm. Faku. He's had a splendid first half. And enjoyed it with another. But lost a bit of their shape now. All the room for Obama Yang. But a good finish to a very good first half from the neutral perspective. A good finish for Arsenal, who got the goal back through Aubame Yang's tap-in. Alexis Sanchez with a happy return to a stadium he knows only too well with the opening goal for Manchester United. In a flash, Jesse Lingard had made it too. Both goals made by Romelu Lukaku, who's roamed from the right-hand side. But Arsenal got the next goal and are still very much in the tie. Half-time at the Emirates. Arsenal 1, Manchester United 2. You got a project, you need a part. So you go to AutoZone.com, you find... Yeah, got one goal back from a 2-0 deficit. No more substitutions, of course, they lost Chocolatees. The Mustafi replaced him early in the piece before the two goals. And Manchester United also no half time substitutions for them. United with the edge. So Arsenal get the second half underway. Finishing the first half strongly. Get their goal. It's Aubame Yang. Make the nice. It might drop for him. Oh, and uh, Romero did very well to keep out Ramsey's header. Oh, what a switch of play it was from Torreira out to Aubameyang. We'll run through for Ashley Young here. Manchester United could be in. And the opponent but it is Lukaku and uh, is Aubameyang. Ramsey set up for the shot. Torreira takes on the back. Bamiyans is in there. Here's Lacazette, his sort of angle, his sort of power. I still feel they might be on the brink of an equaliser here. Lingard helps out here. He's delayed the pass, Pogba. And now he's uh, put it through for Rashford. The flag was up. And Lingard made a good run. Pogba didn't see that one. And great feet from Pogba here. Rashford holds his position, Pogba goes it alone, it's pushed out for Martial, and Manchester United are heading for the fifth round of the FA Cup. There was the counter-attack. And Ole Gunnar Solskjaer has used his substitutions, it could have been for Rashford, in the end it came for Martial, and it's Arsenal 1, Manchester United 3. Well, earlier on I was talking about Pogba looking slightly tired when he was running with the ball, not this time, he galloped away from the Arsenal players, they backed off, they backed off, here's where they lose it, Pogba wins it back here, and he races away from Torreira, nobody's going to catch him up, 
Ginduzi doesn't make a big enough ever. They back off, they back off, and he's certainly not offside. Martial, yes, Petr Cech could have pushed it round for a corner. It's a decent save for him, but he pushes it straight out to Martial, who makes no mistake with the finish, and he was onside. He held on to it. It's very difficult for a goal. It just